So I stayed up to like 2 a.m. writing this essay. It took me like, I don't know, two hours. Hey, uh, what's today's theme for today? I think it could be honesty. <gasps> oh no! What happened here? Someone saw their papers all over the floor. Does anyone know who made the mess? This is the biggest mess I've ever seen. Well, we didn't do it. Well, then who did it? Well, it wasn't me. I've never done anything like this. I didn't do it. Well, one of you had to do it. It doesn't happen on its own. It's better if you be honest and tell us who did it. How are we supposed to find out who did it if no one's being honest? Oh, wait, hold on. I know. Super awesome helper person. Super awesome helper person? My super awesome senses tell me that something here isn't super awesome. It looks like somebody made a mess in here. Do we know who? No, we don't. And no one's telling us who did it. Can you help us? Of course I can. Today, kids, we'll be talking about honesty and why it's important to tell the truth. Now, let's figure this out. It's gonna be the greatest day. Woke up and I was shouting hooray. Going to school to learn and play. Oh, my teacher gives me an A. All my work is done. No son to have some fun. I'm gonna grab my baby's name. Fill my carpet and relax. It's gonna be great, my friends with me. We're all here watching the TV. And you know when you hear the song, it's time for your favorite sing along. Time. Hey look! What's that? It looks like a wallet! I wonder whose it is! I don't know. Maybe we should give it to a teacher. Or we could keep it. Just look at how much money is in here. No, that's not right. But we could buy some candy. But it's not our money. But I found it, so that makes it mine. I don't think it's a good idea for you to keep it. If it was yours, wouldn't you want it back? Well yeah, I'd want it back. Hey, have you guys seen the wallet anywhere? No, we haven't. Okay. Super awesome, awesome helper person. person. My super awesome senses tell me that something here isn't super awesome. I lost my wallet. Oh no, do you remember where you last had it? No, but this is the only place I haven't looked. Well, I don't see it anywhere. Let's hope the person who found it is honest and returns it to you. Okay, I found my wallet. I'm sorry. I should have been honest from the beginning. Thank you. See, kids, it's important to be honest so you don't make people upset. So, whenever you find something that isn't yours, always try and return it to its owner. Today, we're going to be spelling some words that relate to today's theme, honesty. Wow, that's great. That's amazing. Honesty is our first word. Now, spell it with me. H. H. O. O. N. N. E. E. S. S. T. T. Y. Y. Honesty means to tell the truth, which brings us to our next word, truth. Spell it with me. T. T. R. R. U. U. T. T. H. H. Telling the truth means saying something that's true, which is the right thing to do, which brings us to our next word, right. Spell it with me. R R I I G G H H T T Doing the right thing means doing something that is morally acceptable, which will help people trust you, which brings us to our last word, trust. Spell it with me. T T R R U U S S T T Today, we saw some situations in which telling the truth is important. Here's some examples of situations where you can be honest. Admitting to talking in class. Returning what you borrowed. Going where you said you were going. And telling an adult you broke something. 
Now that we've talked about what situations are honest, it's also important to talk about what situations are dishonest. Looking at someone else's test. Or cheating at a game. Saying you didn't hit someone when you did. And keeping a dollar you found on the ground. Now that we've talked about both honesty and dishonesty, here are some phrases to help you remember the meaning of honesty. H is for helping others around you. O is for owning up to your actions. N is for no cheating or lying. E is for everybody every day. S is for showing respect. T is for telling the truth. And Y is for you can do it. Now that we've given you some situations and given you a great way to remember honesty, we hope you are better prepared to be honest in your everyday life. There is no debate, don't lie like that guy, he makes people cry, that's why we don't lie. Super awesome helper guy, he is really wise, he's an honest guy. I am in the booth, rapping about the truth, Owen lied twice, and that is not nice. Come on guys, just tell us who did it. Well, I had nothing to do with this. Yes, you did. You pulled out all the pens. Well, you threw the papers all over the floor. S Stop arguing. Guys, we're not here to be mad at you. We just want you to be honest with us. I was the one that made the mess. I'm sorry. I was afraid I was going to get in trouble, so I lied. Thank you for telling the truth. It was my fault too. I did throw the pens all over the floor. Well, thank you both for being honest. Being honest in a bad situation can make it a lot better. So kids, today we learned that being honest is one of the best things you can do. Yay! Yay!